My name is Michael Holmes. I'm scientific director of Montana Instruments. My research background is in optical physics, specifically ultra cold atoms from the University of Rochester. Today, I'm going to talk about one of the key components of our crowd microscope, that is the crowd optic. Shown in this figure is a crowd optic within the low vibration crowd station platform. Top A is a composite diagram of the crowd microscope setup highlighting the critical components. In the bottom photograph B is an upside down view of the entire objective housing showing the one millimeter aperture in detail from the point of view of the ATS platform in the sample. The 4K stage mounting region sits within the 30K stage. The sample's radiation shield is supported rigidly and thermally connected to the 30K stage. The radiation shield thermally protects the sample and helps overall temperature stability by lagging wires, fibers, and other loads that may cause heating. Built-in Adacute 101 Series XYZ nano positioners handle sample translation and focus, providing millimeter translation with nanometer resolution. A flexible thermal link connects the 4K stage to the ATS platform, holding the sample. The positioner not only controls movement, but poses significant thermal load and will limit the agility of the system without the ATS platform. The sample radiation shield and ejector housing are attached and referenced by mating together at the shield junction, all in vacuum. The enclosure for the optic is threaded and allows vertical coarse positioning. Although this bond provides a rigid positional reference, the two sections are thermally disconnected within the shield junction. That is, there's no direct metal-to-metal -metal contact for heat transfer. The vacuum compatible high NA objective has a working distance of 310 micron, providing the best light collection available in a closed cycle crowd stack. Even at 310 microns away, the sample temperature does not rise more than a few millikelvin. This is a result of the excellent optical design of the objective radiation shield and one millimeter aperture, allowing faster thermal response. Furthermore, the entire unit is isolated from room and environmental conditions by the outer housing. This significantly improves drift down to nanometer per degree Kelvin as compared to typical optics mounted outside, which can be as high as a few millimeter. The outside of the objective and housing are wrapped in a heat coil and temperature stabilized with respect to room temperature to within a few hundred nanokelvin, making it immune to temperature fluctuations in the laboratory resulting in ultra-stable high-quality imaging from the top window. Contact me to discuss your research and how the crawl optic might fit into the bigger picture. Thank you.